What's up, Vikes? I'm Jessica, and you're watching SVTV. We are making stories by teens for teens. Creating a platform, finding character, and giving others a voice. This is SVTV. Group A will take pictures on Monday and Tuesday. Group B will take pictures on Thursday and Friday during English classes. Remote learners can come in any of those four days between 8 and 3. For more information, check Schoology. This year's Fall Play auditions will be tomorrow and Thursday at 3.30 with callbacks on Friday. For more information, please contact Mr. Stuff. Interact Mask Drive through the month of September. You can donate mask, homemade, and store-bought accepted. See Schoology for more information. A virtual sleep in the box is happening on October 3rd. Talk to Mr. Collins for more information. The Writing Center will be open for online appointments starting today. See the Schoology course to sign up. Please email Ms. Sands if you have any questions. The speed limit in the parking lot is 10 miles per hour. Please obey the speed limit. Seaman High School property is closed from 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. unless there's a school function still occurring. During this time, the Shawnee County Sheriff's Office will tell you to leave if they see gatherings at the lots. Congratulations to the 2021 National Honor Society officers, Lauren Beavers, Caden Fox, and Kylie Jones. Now for your sports announcements. The Seaman Boys varsity football team beat Hayden 28-22 on Friday. Congrats, Vikes. Congratulations to the Lady Vikes cross-country team on an excellent second-place finish at the Joe Scrag Invitational. The boys' cross-country team also competed at the Joe Scrag Invitational. Varsity and JV both finished third. Congratulations to those runners who medaled. That's all for today, Vex. Have a great day. I hate this chain. Ow, ow.